Hi, kids. Today, we will learn how important is our atmosphere and what's polluting it. So let's start. Our Earth is surrounded by a blanket of air called atmosphere. It is composed of a mixture of gases, dust particles, and water vapors. The atmosphere protects the Earth and allows life on Earth. The atmosphere contains 21% of oxygen that living things need for respiration. The atmosphere contains 0.03% carbon dioxide, which all plants need for respiration. The solar radiations or solar energy passes through atmosphere before reaching the Earth's surface. The solar radiations also contain harmful ultraviolet rays, and these harmful ultraviolet rays are filtered out by the ozone layer, which is a part of the atmosphere. And life on Earth gets only the good part of the solar radiations. When the Earth gets heated upon, Getting this solar radiation, the Earth's surface reflects off this energy into the space at nighttime. But gases like carbon dioxide absorbs these reflected radiations and prevents Earth from becoming freezing cold by reflecting off all the solar radiations. And this is known as greenhouse effect. As if all the heat reflected back by the Earth's surface is allowed to escape into the space. Our Earth will become too cold at night that life cannot survive. It is the atmosphere because of which optimum temperatures is maintained on Earth for the life to exist on Earth. So without atmosphere, we would be burned by the intense heat of the sun during the day or frozen by the very low temperatures at night. The atmosphere also shields the Earth from collisions with meteors and other small heavenly bodies. As these small heavenly bodies burn in the sky before hitting the Earth's surface, so atmosphere acts as our shield. Oxygen levels of 21% is maintained by the atmosphere, which is just apt for the life to survive. The atmosphere plays an important role in water cycle too. Water, one of the most essential elements for living things, is present in the air, water bodies, underground, and even on hilltops. And this water is in a mode of continuous movement on, above, or below the surface of the earth. And this movement of water is called water cycle. And this water cycle, too, is regulated with the help of our atmosphere. So, kids, it's the atmosphere that provides necessary gases for living things to survive. And it's the atmosphere that regulates the heat from the sun to just the right temperature on Earth. And it's the atmosphere that plays a very important role in water cycle too. And it's the ozone layer of atmosphere that protects the living things from the harmful UV rays. Our atmosphere also protects us from heavenly bodies like meteors. In our solar system, only two planets other than Earth have atmospheres, and they are Venus and Mars. Kids, we learned how important our atmosphere is. But unfortunately, we are polluting our atmosphere. Let's see what is air pollution. The presence of unwanted and harmful substances in the air is termed as Air pollution. Any additional gases, particles, 
or odors that are introduced into the air can cause harm to the living things and can be termed as pollution. Pollutants. Things that pollute the air are called pollutants. Common examples of pollutants include nitrogen oxides, carbon monoxides, hydrocarbons, sulfur oxides, sand, dust particles, and organic compounds. Pollutants can be classified into two types. Primary pollutants, secondary pollutants. Primary pollutants are those gases or particles that are introduced into the air through activities like volcanoes, dust storms, smoke from forest fires, vehicles, thermal power plants. They are all gases like carbon monoxide, sulfur dioxide, and dust particles. Now let's see what are secondary pollutants. When primary pollutants in the air mix up, they form even more harmful substances in the air, which are called secondary pollutants. Smog is an example of secondary pollutants. Smog is a form when fog is mixed with smoke and a poisonous form of fog is formed, which we call as smog. So kids, that's all for today. Today we learnt what is atmosphere? What is the role of atmosphere? What is pollution? And various types of pollutants. Now you may go ahead and take a quiz to learn more. Bye-bye. Tootway has thousands of animated videos on math, English, and science to clear the core basics of these subjects.